So what's going on guys, it's JM at Speedboxing. Make sure you subscribe to my channel before you click onto any of my videos. Also comment below in the comment section if you have any opinions on what I'm saying in any of my videos. It really helps me out if you guys could drop me a sub or two on my channel, it is appreciated. So today we had the weigh-ins for the Anthony Joshua Vladimir Klitschko fight. Tomorrow night in front of 90,000 people at Wembley Stadium. And the weights today for this fight were very interesting. Vladimir Klitschko came in at a very low 240 pounds and it just showed that Vladimir Klitschko at 41 years of age just took this fight very seriously because he's in fantastic shape, he's at a lower weight than people expected and he's been using the hashtag obsessed throughout this fight, throughout the build up and it definitely showed today that he's been working very hard for this fight and there's Vladimir Klitschko coming in light, a part of his game plan is he trying to employ the quicker tactics in there he's trying to be the quicker man because at 41 years of age i think anthony joshua is slightly quicker than vladimir klitschko at this stage but both men are very stiff upright kind of boxers anyway and anthony joshua surprisingly weighed in at 250 pounds that's the career highest anthony joshua has been in a fight and that tells me that anthony joshua doesn't want this fight to go very long so is he going to try and get in there straight away and use his strength against Vladimir Klitschko? Also, it could be a thing because Vladimir Klitschko likes to hold in fights. When the guys are throwing shots at him, he likes to hold. So is Anthony Joshua coming in big in this fight? So Vl Vladimir Klitschko can't hold on to him so he can use his strength to push Vladimir Klitschko off and land his own shots to try and get Vladimir Klitschko out. But... Former undisputed heavyweight champion of the world, Lennox Lewis, said that Anthony Joshua's weight was very heavy. That a lot of muscle to move around for 12 rounds. Like that's a lot of muscle to move around for that long of time. And he has to watch his stamina in the fight. And Lewis is right in a way because what if Vladimir Klitschko is a tougher task than Anthony Joshua expected and he has to really work for it to try and get Vladimir Klitschko out of there in the fight seven, eight rounds deep. How's Joshua's stamina going to hold up? Because it's all these people are saying, oh, Anthony Joshua trains every day. He's very fit and stuff like that. Yeah, but it's a 12-round fight. And it doesn't matter how hard you train sometimes. Some guys just have better gas tanks than others. And with the amount of muscle Anthony Joshua is carrying, will it be able to affect him if the fight goes eight or nine rounds? Will it be his downfall? But I don't think Anthony Joshua wants this fight to go very long because that's why he's weighing in this high because he's not going to allow Vladimir Klitschko to hold on to him he's going to use his strength to not allow that to happen and try and get his own shot so yeah this is just my opinion on this comment below in the comment section it's JM it's speedboxing